In the first half of 2021, from January 2021 to June 2021, around 2,000 Dubai residents from different nationalities took their shahada. 2,000! That's a significant figure, alhamdulillah. For those who don't know, shahada is the declaration of oneness of Allah Almighty and Muhammad, peace be upon him, as his final prophet. In this way, whoever accepts this enters the circle of religion Islam. He gets bound to follow all the principles and rules Islam offers for his or her success. And last year in 2020, some 2,570 residents embraced Islam in Dubai from January to September remotely due to travel restrictions. This proves nothing can stop the religion of Islam from entering into people's heart, subhanAllah. According to Dubai news reports, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the ruler of Dubai, wants to make Dubai a beacon for moderate Islam in the region and the world. We don't know what he meant by moderate. However, let's hope that it is what Allah Almighty has commanded and pleased with. These official statistics about conversion in Dubai have been revealed by a center. This center is under the aegis of Islamic Affairs and Charitable Activities Department in Dubai. How come this happened? Who made these non-Muslims aware of what Islam is? And how did they attract towards it? It is this center that introduces Islam principles to new Muslims. Hannah Al Jalaf, head of Welfare Department for New Muslims, confirmed that based on the civilized discourage of the center promoting the values of tolerance, the acquaintance of residents with the Emirates and Islamic culture led to the fact of 2,027 residents of Dubai converted to Islam. Some of the converts feared the reaction of their relatives, so they kept their names and the department helped them to do this for their safety while maintaining complete confidentiality of their appeal. Some, he said, did not even talk about their treatment upon returning home, fearing intolerance from their relatives and he added, Islam has no objection to them keeping their conversion secret. The director of the center, Hind Muhammad Luta, ensures that center must introduce rules of Islam to new Muslims. He stresses very spiritual, educational and support to them. The organization participates in dismantling information and portraying a positive image of Islam among people of other religion while guiding new Muslims into Islam's practice and basic principles. For doing this, this center uses all technical means and human resources to reach a different group of people living in Dubai. On the other hand, to know more about Islam or to declare the oath, there are several means from the center. It provides a small service portal, a call center. You can also visit the center just to gather the info and use the smart screen to help oneself take shahada or just the knowledge about religion. Although Islam is the official religion in Dubai, other religions are also accepted and tolerated by the government. Other aspects too make it the most unusual country in the Middle East. For example, there is a permit to drink alcohol by non-Muslims, rent a room by unmarried couple, etc. It is because 90% of the Dubai and UAE population comprises migrants. This mainly includes Hindus and Christians from India, Bangladesh, the Philippines, Indonesia and Egypt. However, everyone is bound to respect Islam and follow the laws and culture. So there is freedom of religion in Dubai and nobody is forced to accept Islam. Converting to Islam is their choice. Most Christians share their experience which tells the basic reason behind conversion was the well-being and kindness of Muslims. Muslims behavior made them feel mingled despite many differences. The non-Muslims felt themselves the part of the community and embraced Islam. Thus most of the converts to Islam were of Christian background. About half of the converts before Islam were Protestants and the remaining ones were Catholic. According to the latest UAE census in 2005, Islam is the religion of 70% of the population. However, Christian comprises 9% and 50% by the other religions including Buddhists and Hindus.